Bloomberg Business Week, Wikipedia Article Audio Bloomberg Business Week is an American weekly business magazine published by Bloomberg LP. Business Week was founded in 1929. The magazine was created to provide information and interpretation about what was happening in the business world. It is headquartered in New York City. Megan Murphy was appointed editor of the magazine in November 2016. She stepped down from the role in January 2017. Joel Weber was appointed in her place. The magazine is published 47 times a year. Busina's Week was first published in September 1929, weeks before the stock market crash of 1929. The magazine provided information and opinions on what was happening in the business world at the time. Early sections of the magazine included marketing, labor, finance, management, and Washington Outlook, which made Business Week one of the first publications to cover national political issues that directly impacted the business world. History Bloomberg LP Acquisition Business Week was originally published to be a resource for business managers. However, in the 1970s, the magazine shifted its strategy and added consumers outside the business world. Since 1975, Business Week has carried more annual advertising pages than any other magazine in the United States. Stephen B. Shepard served as editor-in-chief from 1984 until 2005 when he was chosen to be the founding dean of the CUNY Graduate School of Journalism. Under Shepard, Business Week's readership grew to more than 6 million in the late 1980s. He was succeeded by Stephen J. Odler of the Wall Street Journal. Business Week suffered a decline during the late 2000s recession as advertising revenues fell one-third by the start of 2009 and the magazine's circulation fell to 936,000. In July 2009, it was reported that McGraw-Hill was trying to sell Business Week and had hired Evercore partners to conduct the sale. Because of the magazine's liabilities, it was suggested that it might change hands for the nominal price of $1 to an investor who was willing to incur losses turning the magazine around. In late 2009, Bloomberg LP bought the magazine reportedly for between $2 million to $5 million plus assumption of liabilities and renamed it Bloomberg Business Suite. It is now believed McGraw-Hill received the high end of the speculated price at $5 million, along with the assumption of debt. Currently, the magazine still loses $30 million per year, about half of the $60 million it was reported losing in 2009. Odler resigned as editor-in-chief and was replaced by Josh Tyergeel, who had been deputy managing editor of Time magazine. In early 2010, the magazine title was restyled Bloomberg Business Week as part of a redesign. Megan Murphy is the third editor of the magazine in the eight years of Bloomberg ownership. The magazine is reportedly losing between $20 to $30 million a year. In June 2017, the magazine underwent substantial changes, taking it more upmarket and closer to peers such as The Economist. The graphic design became more serious slash less playful and various sections such as etc. were dropped. Recent History Since 1988, Business Week has published annual rankings of United States Business School MBA programs. In 2006, it also started publishing annual rankings of undergraduate business programs. 
International editions of Bucinas Sweek were available on newsstands in Europe and Asia until 2005 when publication of regional editions was suspended to help increase foreign readership of customized European and Asian versions of Business Week's website. However, the same year the Russian edition was launched in collaboration with Rodionov Publishing House. Business School Rankings At the same time, Bucina Sweek partnered with InfoPro Management, a publishing and market research company based in Beirut, Lebanon, to produce the Arabic version of the magazine in 22 Arab countries. In 2011, Bloomberg Bucina Sweek continued the magazine's international expansion and announced plans to introduce a Polish-language edition called Bloomberg Bucina Sweek Polska, as well as a Chinese edition which was relaunched in November 2011. Bloomberg Bucina Sweek launched an iPad version of the magazine using Apple's subscription billing service in 2011. The iPad edition was the first to use this subscription method, which allows one to subscribe via an iTunes account. There are over 100,000 subscribers to the iPad edition of Bucinas Sweek. Additional versions In 2011, Adweek named Bloomberg Bucinas Sweek as the top business magazine in the country. In 2012, Bloomberg Bucina Sweek won the General Excellence Award for General Interest Magazines at the National Magazine Awards. Also in 2012, Bloomberg Bucina Sweek editor Josh Tyrgeal was named Magazine Editor of the Year by Ad Age. In 2014, Bloomberg Bucina Sweek won a Society of American Business Editors and Writers Best in Business Award for Magazines. General Excellence Honors and Awards Name and Spelling History